channel it's your girl Zoe, the one and the only and i'm passionate about identity i feel like yeah one of the most crucial 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 things to figure out in your in your life and most and preferably your early life is your identity and who you are the reason this is so important is because pretty much everything we do and every decision we make should be aligned with our identity aligned with who we are aligned with our purpose you know every decision we make should have some sort of direction have some sort of vision have some sort of boundary you know like we need to know what to say yes to and what to say no to you need to know what you need and require from a partner in a relationship for me personally yeah if I tell you lot the mistakes the mistakes I made purely because I just didn't know who I was I didn't know what my morals were I didn't know what my values were I didn't know what makes me happy I didn't know what I need from other people I don't think you understand the weighting that the decisions we make has and how much the decisions we make have to be aligned with our identity if I'm saying yes to this job is it aligned with my identity with who I am with what I want to do if I'm saying yes to marrying this person boy oh boy do I even know who I am how can you get to know someone yeah and you don't know who you are so you're just going to end up going everywhere doing everything becoming friends with everyone like for me I was becoming friends with anyone that was coming my way I was entertaining any man that was coming my way and I'm not proud to say it now but thank you Jesus for the transformation but really and truly that's what it was like I was entertaining because I didn't know who I was I didn't understand my worth I didn't understand my value I didn't understand my boundaries you know what I need from people and what I can give to people and when you know that it's so crucial because the decisions you make change like now every time I make a decision it's aligned with who I am it's aligned with my destiny aligned with my purpose aligned with what my identity is you know like for example for me I know that I don't deal well with stress at all when I get really overwhelmed I completely shut down my brain just shuts off because I can't like I can't process my stress very well I'm not very good at dealing with stress and being overwhelmed so I know that I need to take steps before I get overwhelmed. For example, my happy place. My happy place is the swimming pool. If ever I'm stressed, if ever I'm upset, if ever I need to think, swimming. Do you know what I mean? Like swimming for me, that's my place like to clear my mind, to stop me from being overwhelmed. And different people have different things. For some people it's painting, for some people it's making music. Whatever that may be for you, you need to know that so you can avoid things like getting overwhelmed, getting stressed, having a breakdown, getting depressed. You need to know who you are. You can make the right decisions in life. That's why so many people end up in jobs that they absolutely hate. That's why so many people end up in marriages that they hate. When you don't know who you are, you're going to end up molding yourself to fit what other what you think other people want from you let's say you're a guy right you don't know who you are and you meet a girl because you don't know who you are you're just gonna try and fit the image that they want from you if you know this girl likes nice things you're gonna splash out all your money on nice things for her if you know that she's the extrovert you're probably gonna try and you know match her energy like try and do things like go out all the time with her if that is not truly who you are you're not gonna be able to uphold that I'm not an expert but I'm pretty sure that's why so many marriages and relationships break down because people are trying to uphold a standard or a personality or an image that's just not them and you can't you can't do that forever you will get tired you'll get stressed you'll become depressed because you're being someone who you're not this is why it is so important like I could give you so so many more examples think of all the youth who are out here I genuinely believe if these young people knew their worth knew their value knew their purpose knew what God has in store for them their name is written on this path if they knew if they could see if they could understand I genuinely believe that a lot of young people's problems would be solved a lot of depression would be solved a lot of anxiety would be solved if you don't know who you are you're entering a friendship you're just gonna end up copying that friend all the time because you don't know who you are so you're gonna try oh okay I like this personality I'm gonna try and adopt what they're doing I'm gonna try wear the clothes they're wearing I'm gonna try go to the places they're going and do you will become tired no human yeah unless you're some sort of supernatural force no human can keep that up for their whole life and you don't want to be in a position where you get to like 50 years old and you realize rah i've been faking this whole thing this is who i really am you don't want to get to that point where you're 50 years old and you're realizing everything in your life is not what you want 
the job that you're in is not what you want the marriage you're in is not for you it's better to figure out who you are now while you are young while you're in your prime do you know what i mean like this is the best and most crucial time to finding out who you are the decisions you make now affect the rest of your life and it's not to say like you have to make perfect choices now but knowing who you are and knowing your identity helps get you on the right track helps propel you towards purpose so i just want to encourage you that if you don't if i was to ask you right now who are you and you can't answer that question i really want to encourage you to just go and use this time deep it guys we're in lockdown we we actually have time whether you have uni work or actual work or anything there's still hours in the day use this time to reflect use this time to think you know what makes me happy what makes me sad am i an introvert or am i an extrovert what do i enjoy doing are you the type of person that needs a lot of attention and a lot of love and a lot of affection in a relationship or are you the type of person that needs your space all of these things like you need to figure them out because they are crucial like deeper if you don't know the answers to these questions you actually can't figure out exactly what you need in this life and if you can't figure out what you need in this life it's gonna lead to pain it's gonna lead to heartbreak and i, I just don't want to see anyone else go through that i so much of my pain in this life and so much of my heartbreak in this life has been because of identity crisis me literally not knowing who i am at all and i don't regret anything because i've learned my lesson but you don't have to go through certain things to learn you can learn from other people's mistakes and i'm telling you knowing who knowing who you are knowing what your identity is should be up there at the top of your list because it is so crucial to the rest of your life anyway thanks for listening to me chat rubbish about, about this for like the past 10 minutes but it's just something that like i'm just so passionate about and i just don't want to see any more people go on through their lives and just not know who they are and what their identity is and not know what they're worth not know their value oh if you not only knew oh your life will change your life will change your life different different Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all of that jazz.